You lie all the time. You just told me that Pavit was going to Vietnam next week. So I'm having a staycation finally. He's going to Vietnam in a couple of weeks, and so I want to. I'm like really happy that he planned this before that. Now he's going to Vietnam when a ticket opens up. That's I, what she told okay, me. Okay, listen. He has to go when the f***ing tickets open up. Why? It doesn't matter. When I discuss it with okay, my husband. you're telling me you never lied, but I'm telling you. I didn't lie that. about that. That's what we discussed that day or that week. He said the tickets have to open up. He was you know, trying to get this week. day, just I don't care. I don't and care. I don't care either. I seriously am like so over this mean, mean girl sh and it is mean girl sh it's no one's training. being a mean girl. Yes, you just are. Just so you make you no are. sense when you, you are. speak. You literally you are. You cannot answer a question and you speak I in don't circles. get a chance, Sai. The minute I try, this is what happens. She, your f***ing pet parrot. My pet parrot is talking, so she's not even involved. Exactly. Exactly well, what? Well, no, I'm saying this is what happens. It's like a f***ing, like... She's not, it's just me and you talking right now. She's talking to Uba. I'm sitting here with you. You have, you have my phone. <laughs> I'm sitting with you. You f***ing had me sitting here for 35 minutes and didn't even have the decency to call me. You want to help her? No. I'm hungry. Like, I, I don't even want to be at the lunch. I, I don't want to be at this so lunch. Why did you waste come? my f***ing time. Why did you come? Because I was being nice. OK, It was well. a waste of my time OK, lunch. good. Good. I'm glad. I'm actually so f***ing over you. Yeah, well, like, I've been be over let's you, be too. Let's be done. I'm out. I am done. Diva. I just don't get her. She also thinks like she's like lying on everything. Remember the whole thing about this Vietnam thing? Wait, what's the Vietnam thing? I'm I'm going to Vietnam soon, and then just next I guess, week, right? Well, I don't. There's no timeline. You did tell me at the sex shop it was booked. You know, he wants to go to Vietnam because he wants his alone time. So he had a ticket booked before COVID. And okay. then he kept pushing it and pushing it and pushing it. And so now he has to go because oh, it's going to gonna expire. OK, OK. He, it, is it is booked. It's he has booked for three years. The thing is, the flights are not open yet. So they're supposed to open like, literally any second now because they just open up the borders. And I'm second. I'm counting down the second. But like, also, who cares? Like, well, that's who the whole point, cares? though. Yeah. I wouldn't lie about something. That's so stupid thing to lie about. Let's get some more champagne. Do you know what Erin told me? Mm. She was like, "Oh my God, Uba asked the cutest question and went around and asked like, how did you meet the person you love?' But or no, something. why you love? Yeah, we go why? Yeah. And Erin was like, "What?" Pavit said was like, "I like Jessel because she lets me do what I want." Um, that's exactly not what he said. No. No. It's being able to do what you love with someone else. And they put up with your sh And she's like, it was so weird. He wasn't wearing his ring. And she's like, I don't know what's going on. Whoa. <laughs> Is she trying to imply, what the f are you serious? Am I right now stirring the pot and did it? Yes, but you know what? This is a serious topic. Pop it! Friends are the place where you should go when you're having marital problems or help them through it. We shouldn't be trying to poke holes in people's marriages. The only time you want to poke holes is in condoms with really rich men. <laughs> Seriously, though.